Challenge here and welcome back to my channel and as you can see by the title this is a collaboration video um, recently uh, the lovely lady Marwa who run, won one of my giveaways um, she I didn't realize she had a channel and I've been watching her since I found out um, she recently contacted myself and a few other youtuber ladies and asked if we wanted to have this uh, a go of this 10 minute makeup challenge so I thought I think I've done it before way back uh previously just off my own back just just had a go of it i don't know whether i completed it but i thought i'd give it a go again and collab with these lovely ladies so the ladies that are collabing with me for this makeup challenge are i can't speak today i don't know what's going on are myself uh obviously lady mawa sussex sandra lightning lass lucy Perkface, diary 40 something and the lovely willow biggs if you guys have followed me for a while you know that I uh, always mention these ladies in a lot of my videos they all do the same sort of thing as myself obviously with a few added extras uh, you have Sussex Sandra who does lovely unboxings uh, and she also reviews makeup uh, Lady Marwa she does the same sort of thing also she does like a I think it's Slimming World sorry if I got that wrong I like a Slimming World diary and things like that so if you're into your dieting and you want tips and things like that maybe you want to go over and watch her videos for that as well but she also does like she has a makeup side which is uh, I like watching the makeup videos so yeah I, I hop over when she's uh, uploaded some new because she's just uploaded some revolution stuff if you want to go and check that out which she got for an absolute steal for four pound each product you really should go and check that video out because she got a right bargain there um obviously you guys know Lucy Perkface she's the same as me she does a lot more family vlogs though she has her family vlogs she has her unboxing she has reviews product testing makeup looks all that sort of stuff lightning lass is the same she's like an unboxing queen as well as diary of a 40 something they do their unboxings and review things uh, beauty products and um, pretty much the same as my channel and then you've got Willow Biggs who does her she's a, the bath bomb queen she loves she has oh, if you anything you want to know about Lush you go and see Willow for it because she she has so many like she's like obsessed with bath bombs more than I am she absolutely loves bath bombs and loves her lush and she knows everything about it but she also does makeup uh, looks too and uh, unboxings that sort of thing so we're all in the similar sort of umbrella of category of things that we do uh, so I really really think you should go and check them all out because they're all lovely as well and they're easy to watch and I, I just think you should support us because that'd be amazing so now that I've rambled and I hope I've mentioned everybody but everybody will be listed in the description box below um, I think <laughs> as scared as I am to start this we shall get into the 10 minute makeup challenge so I have my products laid out in front of me and I'm going to randomly just go really really quick because I'm not very fast when it comes to my makeup I like to take my time so I'm going to struggle with this because uh, generally on a day that I'm wearing full makeup it takes me about an hour to put my makeup on if it's just a school run I can cut it down to about half an hour and that's just using mineral makeup that's like mineral foundation that's not using like proper stick foundation which I will be using today so like Sandra you recommended it and I thought about it as well so I thought it might be really easy and to use in this video so I'm gonna use that um, but yeah mineral foundation is just a quick whoosh, and then I can go do the school run so but even that takes me a good 20 minutes to half an hour to to because I start and think I'll just put mineral foundation on to go to the school and then I end up adding a little bit of eyeshadow then I think oh no I can't go out without my eyebrows done as you can see from my naked face and tired face because it was a late one last night with little Edward um yeah so I don't have much in the way of eyebrows going on and I do fill them in so they, they look like they're a bit fuller not overly full I'm not all this I can't do thick brows because my eyebrows would probably look really strange but um I'm gonna stop rambling because I'm gonna stop rambling now because um I need to get into this I'm just a bit scared I'm avoiding it but I'm gonna just get into it and I'm going to put on my 10 minute <sighs> alarm so that's your camera, Murray. <laughs> uh, clock. There we go. Right. Alarm. So stopwatch timer. That's the one we want. And we want it set for 10 minutes. Obviously, I've already primed my face. I've just put some moisturiser on to prime my face today. Um, but I just thought I'd do that because it's not really applying makeup. It's just putting moisturiser on. So we have 10 minutes on the clock. I am so scared because I am so going to fail this. I know I am. 
but I'm going to give it a go. So, foundation brush at the ready. <laughs> so, I'm going to start the timer now. <laughs> and then I'm going to apply my foundation. So, this is obviously going to be a hopefully a quick way of me applying my foundation and I hope this really works well because if it doesn't it's going to backfire majorly so foundation oh god I really hope I can pull this off guys so if I do go quiet it's just because I'm concentrating <laughs> and I don't want to fail but I really really don't want to fail I want to get like a full face of makeup on if I can so not going to be overly see this is the problem with me when i apply makeup i go over the top when it comes to applying things so it's just like really hard i go over crazy with blending and stuff so it, that's why it takes me so long to apply makeup because i'm a bit too critical of myself sometimes when it comes to the old makeup and yeah so i really hope i can uh, pull this off <laughs> so we're on to our concealer and I'm just going to use a brush purely for quickness reasons and just smack <laughs> I'm going to smack this stuff all over my face and hope for the best and hope that it looks nice when I finish so we're not doing too bad so far <laughs> we're not doing too bad okay so we are going in next with some setting powder just going to use this banana setting powder Obviously you guys know I've used the Barry M Stick Foundation and the Collection Lasting Perfection Concealer because I love that concealer, it is a good go-to one. But I really, really want to try the um, Makeup Revolution version of it. And now we're going in with our Professional London Pro Artist HD Finishing Powder just to set my foundation or attempt to. Anything with this finishing powder, I feel like it makes me look a little bit white. I don't know. I don't because it's HD. I don't know whether it shows up on the camera, but so that's that. Then we are going in with our contour. Let's do the contour. Like, look how bad this is, guys. Just to show you for a second, I'm totally wasting minutes, but I'm. I'm it is absolutely so well loved this palette it's the uh makeup revolution ultra contour palette oh my gosh uh yeah and it's very well loved i've run out of a lot of them hit pan on most of them to be honest mm -hmm. oh my god i'm probably gonna look like a complete mess i'm gonna look like the worst drag queen not not a drag queen even in a good way because i love drag queens i'm gonna look like a right mess because I'm just trying so hard to get it on so quickly. Seven minutes. We've got seven minutes, guys. Seven minutes. Right. So I've done a little bit of contour. I'm going to do some bronzing now. And I'm using, still using the Makeup Revolution contour palette. And I'm just mixing the two bronzes that are there. I'm really liking like the more bron bronzed and glowy look at the minute. Probably a little bit too much at the minute. Uh, but um yeah i really like that because i feel like because i'm getting less sleep i feel like i look really oh my god oh i feel like i look really really white so i've got a bit ott with the, the whole bronzed look hopefully this doesn't look too bad so that's that and for blush i'm just gonna do blush now it's kind of more it's a benefit sugar bomb uh and it's got got like three different types of uh shades of colour in it like there's more like ready orangey so it's like a, a bronzy blush kind of thing I'm totally gonna look like an umpa lumpa when I'm done doing this <laughs> but it's all good at least I'll have some colour on my face so we are at five minutes five minutes and I've not even applied eyeshadow yet oh my god we're totally gonna fail this so let's just rub that out and should we just do the eyebrows because the eyebrows are what take me ages eyebrows 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 where are you right there's the eyebrows so we're just going to quickly fill these in this is what takes me a, a minute as well to do so i'm going to have to like keep it short and sweet now sorry if i don't look at you guys i need to concentrate on these eyebrows because uh otherwise we're going to have a, an epic fail in our hands 
All right. Oh, five, five minutes exactly now I'm on. So we need to hurry this up so I need at least to get a good few minutes on my eyes so I can get something decent on my face. All right. That is going to have to do. Oh, just going to give them a little brush. Uh, I have you. I have used the Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade on my brows. <laughs> Not really bad, but we're just going to roll with it. Now we're on to eyes. So I'm going in with the chocolate bar palette now, and uh, I'm going to apply some some sort of eyeshadow look in the four minutes and twenty five that I've just looked across and seen. So I'm going in with white chocolate now, just to set the foundation and concealer and all that stuff that I put on my face and then I'm going to go in with a uh, 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 salty caramel just for a transition this is going to be the quickest eye look I've ever done in my life like it's probably not even going to be blended I'm just going to go in and blend that out a little more. I'm going to keep this with like a really, really easy makeup look now from here on out because otherwise, because we have three minutes, three minutes to finish the eyes and do eyeliner. This is not, this is not going to happen today. I'm just going to put a little bit of, I'm going to leave it with this, the caramel colour and I'm just going to bring that on the outer corner just so it looks like a bit more of an eye look than I actually currently have. And I'll come back in a minute and blend it out and if I can add more colour after I will because we had 3 minutes and 14 seconds and that's not good right eyeliner there is no fancy wing happening today guys no, not with 3 minutes because I take way too long to apply eyeliner This is the part where I go silent for concentration. This is the worst eyeliner I've ever applied in my life. If you hear any noises in the background, that is my boiler. <laughs> oh my god, I've got two minutes. What am I going to do in two minutes? What am I going to do? Let's apply some highlighter. <laughs> I've got two minutes and I can't get the highlighter open. I'm going in with this Obsession highlighter that Wacky World of Lottie got me. It is blinding, so I'm trying to be a little bit careful because it really actually is. It's very glowy. I will list all these products that I've used in the description box and we're going in with lip colour for now because I might be able to go back and do my lips I haven't, oh, I haven't put mascara on this is sugar pill oh, trinket and you heard me swear because I cannot edit this At least I've got a colour on my face, even if I did go underneath and you heard me swear for the first time ever. I do apologise to anybody watching. That is the worst lipstick application I've ever done. But yeah, that is it. I've got one minute. One minute. Should I just apply a little bit more colour to my eyes? Just in this one minute. I can go in with a little bit of this. Just here. Just to finish it off. Oh no, I haven't. I've got it. Oh my. Oh wow, this is like an epic fail for me. Right, we're going to go in with mascara <laughs> in 40 seconds. Oh, this mascara is nice. This is the first time I've used this one. Is it Doucet mascara? And I've got 20 seconds to apply some eyeliner in the lash in the waterline I 
What are we on? Four seconds. I think that's as good as it's gonna get. <laughs> Three, two, one. Time. We are on time. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. With how I am, with my standards and makeup. I'm really really okay I didn't do too bad I didn't do too bad at all really in that rush and crazy I, I got color on my face I don't know what do you guys think do you think I did okay I don't think I did that great I know I've seen some of the other ladies and I know that they have totally nailed this and I've totally failed this but it is what it is I got makeup I've got a full face of makeup on as well I didn't get a full face last time so I am quite surprised. Obviously I would have gone way more into the eye look, but I've just done something simple for now. Uh, but yeah, I did it in 10 minutes, full face of makeup. Does that mean that I should now start doing my school runs with like this much makeup on my face if I just throw it all on and then go out? <laughs> Maybe I should. But yeah, okay, that is the 10 minute makeup challenge. It's really badly blended and I do apologise because the, the critiquer in me, how critical I am to myself, really wants to get a blending brush on this eyeshadow right now, but I'm not going to. I'm going to hold myself back and that is the 10 minute makeup challenge. All, excuse me, all the other ladies' videos, I can't speak today, I don't know what's going on. It's because I know I can't edit this video because I wanted you guys to see it as it's filmed rather than me chop out where I'm slur my words and skip my words and I do apologize for the swear word being picked up on camera because uh, I got a little bit frustrated with the lipstick um, but yeah everybody that took part in this collaboration their videos their channels will be linked in the description bar below go and check them out like the video share the video support us you know subscribe to our channels because we would absolutely love that we love everybody's support and uh, we love hearing what you guys think in the comments and speaking to you it's just amazing and I love YouTube for that. So I've met so many lovely people whilst doing this and and a lot of the, su the subscribers, you guys, you, you just leave the nicest comments and I just love reading them. Like I said, as I've got the new baby at the minute, I don't always get to my comments to respond straight away. I will eventually, if I don't, I, I do apologize. It's just because things get a little bit crazy with a newborn. Um, but I always go on and I do always read every single comment if you get a little heart you know that I've, I've read that comment and that I've took the time and I, I do really appreciate everybody's support but go and support the other ladies too because you know they're all amazing everybody's amazing that I've met on YouTube so yeah that is it now I've rambled on for about 10,000 hours uh, that is it for this video guys give me a big thumbs up if you think I did okay uh, if you haven't already and you're new here subscribe because I'd really appreciate that and see what else there is to come but that is it for this time guys and I will see you in the next one bye